think intelligent automation really encapsulates well what it's trying to convey. It definitely shows the way that you can take just simple RPA, just simple automation and actually making it more intelligent so that you're not just automating something without any real decisions, but you can actually bring that intelligence, have decisions and workflows based on top of that which is why I really like the ideas in the roadmap that we discussed with Chris and some of the others, the way that Kofax is now building up its portfolio where everything, you know, they all work together as a whole rather than all these separate disparate systems that we can get the extra parts from Kofax and we can just continue building on our solid foundations that we've laid through RPA and we can continue to build those levels up, automate more, get more intelligent, Chris, he's so infectious and I love his passion that he's got and just the way he speaks, it really takes you with him, agreed with everything he said and it was great to see somebody standing up there reiterating everything that you feel inside and hearing it from somebody so senior and just knowing that he's come from this such varied background and coming in now, I think he's going to be a really good you know, breath of fresh air and pumping a lot of that personality that he has.